Picking up every single player other than Zion, who now has to try and retake himself. Looking for FNX. He will get that kill as well. And looking for this 1v2, oh and he God. does it. Zion saves his team after heroics from Steel. He's going to bring MVP to a great chance to take this, but it's FNX. Has to be the impact player. Has to be the hero for Immortals. He's going to get that first kill, defending against the bomb into a one-on-two. They know where he is. He's going to peek back out. He's playing with it. They're sticking this defuse. He's going to find that kill. Can he get the other one in time? Aww. He can. FNX, an incredible play. That's why Immortals have him. With the shot. Steel still spraying away. They will get themselves towards this site, but the bomb has already been dropped. Lovely shot from FNX. And, well, just tapping away, going to take the head off as well. Keep the dream alive. Cutler, in fact, getting himself one more. So maybe this madness will work out, but he needs to do so much. In fact, gets another. It's all on to Cutler. He's going to look for that vital kill and reloading his bow. Eventually will finish. And that round was just... Absolute cluster. I have no idea what. Got both though. Olaf had to back off. Couldn't get the peek to see if they were there. That time he will. Oh, Hello. Look at Olaf. Double headshot. Flusha starts it. Neo takes him with ease as well. Walks out. Three kills now for Neo. And Crims will walk in from Banana again without the armor to try and make this work going with more speed. Has to. Urgency needs to be a factor. Spots where both are, but neither will peek. And he's going to have a tough time winning this. In fact, bomb. Oh, oh, hang on. Hang on. He's got the kit. Does Crims have the time? Yeah, he got does. It. He's, got he's it. on it. He's absolutely done it. That's incredible. That he's the one with the kit, three kills, clutch what? back, and that move by Config is going to be Ali though. Making his way towards Checkers, didn't pick up the Deagle, still on the PT50. Config, great in this position before, finds the first frag and Ooh. the second. He's looking amazing on the AWP, a third, Config! That's why you love me. That's probably the only reason she did. Config tries to get Kerrigan in the corner, manages to do so. He's going to be on the bank. That's not bad. Heal again though, he's going to go forward to the flames. The last time he did this, he found two, drops down, he drops into the crosshair of MSL. So it actually punishes him, and Alu didn't find a kill at all, which means two versus two, bomb plant, but they're going to push, they're going to go aggressive, bomb's going to be planted, they know exactly where he is, oh my god, MSL! They knew where he was, and he still hits both! B, but aggression coming in from Hellraiser's there, opening up connector door, going to find a couple of frags here potentially, lighting them up towards the short tunnel, there it is, Angel finds both. Does indeed, down goes Freiburg and Drake in, Angel's got get right as well. He's been the second prong to the approach, I have to say, when these situations occur. Nice go. shot, Dead Fox what? follows it and it's Drake in the pit. I've been already once or twice this weekend. As it exists, times it well to peek back into the bathrooms. Gets one, two, and three. They line up, down goes their Bomb. options. And then immediately, but zero hits a shot. They may still make this oh, work. Just Last about. second, got just it. barely got there. That's incredible because they thought they had time. And they will get the plant. Forrest as well thought there was no way. He's got to come back and clutch this. No way. Of all the rounds Hellraisers could win after sitting on 13 for what seems like ever, it could be this, but Forrest sprays them both! What a legend. Forrest stepping up. He needs the shot to come in, and they've got him isolated on the bomb site. Phelps getting one with a C-set and a follow-up on Kirby. Great work! But they will take out Fur in return, so it's still a 2 on 2, 25 seconds. Bomb is attempted. Oh, the headshot from Taco, taking down Dupree, and now it's all in device, and he goes down. Phelps stealing the round with a triple Sidewalk kill. Coming in from the high ground, Taco sprays. He can't transfer it on, but Cold is in the corner, and he's going to spray one. Follows up on Dupree, he suddenly gets the transfer. It's a triple kill coming in. Three men coming in with a Glock. Cold takes one. A second headshot coming in. Cold Zero out of bullets. Knife is out. He's jumping all over the place, and eventually Kiyoshima will put him out of his mid Misery, but those two headshots, shocking and stunning phase. Alu will take down first, so it's still a three on three until Kerrigan shows up and drops Fallen. Phelps trying to reload in the back line. He does get one kill. Can he get the last headshot? Now the knives are out there trying to stab him. Phelps versus Alu, and he's gonna get the kill. Phelps with the double and the knife as well. And Kiyoshima says, I'm having none of this madness. I just want to get this bomb down and return this game to some kind of normalcy. He's at the clock out and he's going to be moving up close. Phelps is on the other side. He goes down first. Now next in line is Taco. He's close and oh my god! Kiyoshima, one versus two to clutch it! Ricky moving up. He's got no fear at all. He's a maniac at the moment. Just going to be charging in and may have been a bit too much. Bolts with another two headshots. Molotov, Kusta goes down! Oh my god, Bolts! Unbelievable, taking all three players. Yeah, it's it's going to be tough. They haven't seen this kind of aggression yet. If they get caught off guard by it, the strategy is almost over oh, before dear. it even begins. And here's the peak. He's going to spray him down. They line up two. Crims, oh, that's God. masterful. And the, the round is over.